grocery haul. I'm so excited to show you guys this grocery haul. I went to um, a farm that, well, there was this farm that I used to go to called Low Farm, L-U-L-L. -L -L. And it was just a small place. So I went looking for it today because I haven't been there in a long time and I wanted to get some, some good stuff. So I found Low Farm, but it wasn't the same one. It was, I think, like their bigger farm. The place was huge, and they had everything, and it was so great and wonderful. <laughs> so I was absolutely excited. I pretty much bought everything, and yeah, I'm going to show you guys. Bless you, Bo. Bo just sneezed. So we have some white corn on the cob. Look at these carrots. These are those different colored carrots, you know, like I showed you guys from Trader Joe's. Only these are just little, little ones. They're just small. See the different colors? I bet these are so good. So I bought three bags of them. This is, I covered this with bags from some of the other stuff because it's, they're just so strong. And I don't want them to make everything else taste like onion. But these are just onions. It's a little mix. You got purple onion, white, um, white. I don't, is that a yellow or a white? I'm not sure, but it's just a little mix of them. They smell amazing. We have some baby spinach. We've got two bags of that. And then some candy beets. I've showed you guys these before. You cut them open, they're red and white, like striped almost. They're so good, too. These are Japanese yams. These are amazing. They're so sweet. We have green beans. They were just um, picking their first batch of heirloom tomatoes, so they weren't really the greatest. But next week, he said they'll have them all out. But I did pick up a couple. This one. This one looks like it's going to be really good, actually. In that one. And then these. These are pink tomatoes. I've never heard of them and never tried them, but they're very pretty. So we'll give those a try. I got one green tomato. And then I got two orange tomatoes. These look really good, too. And then this right here, these are lemon cucumbers, which I've seen um, like the seed packets for these, but they show them round. I've never had them, so I don't know, I don't know how they are, but I was really interested in trying them. So I got three of them, lemon cucumbers. I wonder if they taste, right, let's just try one. <laughs> let's see what we got here. That's what it, oh, oh my goodness, it smells so good. That's what it looks like inside. All this stuff needs to be washed, so I'm just gonna cut the skin off of this little piece. I can't explain it. It's useless, huh? It tastes like a cucumber, but lighter. I can't explain it. It doesn't taste like lemon. We have an orange pepper, a green pepper. We have two batches of asparagus right there. Some nectarines. This one is huge. These, these are pretty neat too. I'll show you guys. You get a good one. These are called um, husk tomatoes. And you know what this reminds me of the outside? It reminds me of those Chinese lantern flowers, which I love, but they're hard to grow. Well, in my yard anyways. So you just kind of pop it out of here like this. And you get this little tomato right here. You take it off and you eat it. They're sweet. 
and they taste, um, what do they taste like? They taste weird. <laughs> Not something I buy regularly, but I really wanted to show you guys those. Mmm. These, I got four of them. These are the best, I think these are the best oranges. It is this kind right there. I can't pronounce that, so. These oranges are so good. I got four of those. This stuff is amazing, too. It's like, um, little puff, camel, puffy things. They're so good. Golden camel corn nuggets. I got some jam. Chocolate banana caught my eye, so I thought I would give that a try. They had all different kinds of eggplant. I got three different kinds, and I can't remember all the names to them. Actually, I can't remember none of the names, so there's this one. And this one. So pretty. And then this one I've never seen before. So I'm interested in this. These I got for my brother. These are honey sticks. Anytime I go to a place where they have these, I pick them up some because he really likes them. I got watermelon to try and... Hmm. I don't remember what that one is. Speaking of watermelon, we got some watermelon. This is all different kinds of zucchini and summer squashes. So there's that one, which just looks like a regular summer squash to me. There's this zucchini, which I can't remember the name. Sorry, guys. This one looks similar, but it's different. And then this one I've showed you guys before, but I can't remember the name. And then these, these are so good. These are just little, like, zucchini balls. <laughs> See? They're so cute. And summer squash. And they're just delicious. So I got a whole bunch of those. One of my absolute favorite squashes. Patty pans. That's what these are called. Oh, that's my cucumber stuff. And these come out... I didn't actually expect them to be out this early, but they usually come out towards fall. And they're so good. And I can never find them anywhere. So I was all excited to see these. And the littler they are, the better they taste. When they stack it in real big, they lose a lot of their, like, taste, I guess. And they just become mostly water. So I got some of those. And I got this little one, too. And then I got Dave some chocolate milk. He loves chocolate milk from any of the farms. And I also got him these. These are apple cider donuts. And they're kind of expensive because they're really popular there. They're so good. And then we have this. This is white bean and red pepper bean dip. So I thought I'd give that a try. Sounded and looked good to me. And these, mmm, these are corn nuts. This is ranch, ranch corn nuts. Look at the size of these things. They're huge. Then we have figs. Beautiful figs. Look at them. Oh, figs are so good, guys. Fresh figs. They're just amazing. Let me just show you guys. So, the thing with figs is if you eat too many or if you put the skin on your tongue and you eat a lot of them, you can actually get like a tingling, burning in your tongue. So, what you do is, well, you cut it open. It's probably better. Oh, well, you don't have to cut it open. But you rip it open like this. Now I have fig skin under my nail. See? Do you see this inside? I don't know if that looks beautiful to you guys. It probably doesn't, <laughs> but it does to me. So yummy. So what you do is you put, you eat this whole thing and you put this side down on your tongue and then you eat just the whole thing. Mmm. Oh, you can just eat the insides out like I do. <laughs> All right. 
We have strawberries. Look at these strawberries. They look so good. They're all dark and beautiful. And last thing. Oh no, two more things. We have these little red plums, which I'm sure are delicious. They have fig all over me. And the last thing I got is in this bag over here because I was eating them on the ride home. Dried cantaloupe. So I got a small batch of this. Well, there was two more in there, but I ate them. Just in case I didn't like it. Oh, guys, it's delicious. It's absolutely delicious. It's dried cantaloupe. So good. Okay, guys, that is my grocery haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed all this fun stuff. I'm going to wash everything and eat it all. And yeah, okay, bye, guys. <laughs>